I just thought it was going to be a once in a lifetime opportunity. It's not going to happen again. Um, and I just wanted to be part of it, yeah. It's the biggest cooperative event that's happened for years and years, and so it was really exciting and I wanted to get involved. I think it's important, I've volunteered it before through work. Um, it's an opportunity we get to meet people from other cooperatives and see what the business is doing in a wider sense and see globally the benefits of cooperatives. Um, just so many co-ops coming together and showing exactly what they can do and what can be achieved by having a cooperative. I think often you, even with the largest co-ops, uh, let alone a small co-op like mine, there's five of us, you stuck in the day job, you're the only co-op in your area, the only co-op in town and just the ability to get together with other like-minded people and to swap experiences, swap the ability to do business together and learn and, and just get an oomph, I mean I'm going to go away from this, it's tremendous oomph for things that I can be doing going forward into next year. Oh, I just think it's really good and I think it's good to promote the cooperative and all the different um, elements of the, the cooperative um, to, the, to the public, you know, there's a lot of delegates here as well, but there's also a lot of people coming in off the street that probably don't know what the cooperative is about, um, and I just think it's really good to promote it. I think it does make you appreciate the global nature of cooperatives and really the impact of them on the world's economy and people's lives. It just makes you aware of how many cooperatives there are across the world and how big a movement it is. It just shows you that it's not just something that's going on in the UK, it's something that's worldwide. Oh, this week has been absolutely fantastic. I can't tell you what it's been like. That, you know, you've been meeting members of the public, but then also, you know, presidents of, of different uh, cooperatives from all across the world. You're just meeting all different nationalities. It's just been absolutely fantastic. I had a, an idea for because of working for the cooperative group I understand that cooperatives around the world but I didn't realise there were so many of them. I think the shared ownership model where you're trying to do things and work for a group of individuals as a collective rather than necessarily just for shareholders is a better way of doing things and if you can get people with shared ideas together sometimes they're not always working for financial aims sometimes they work very successfully for financial aims. There's so many problems in our society at the moment you know, you've got um, the ongoing uh, economic problems coming out of the financial crisis, young people who can't find work, a breakdown in trust in conventional forms of business. And I think cooperatives provide a solution to so many of society's problems, but so many people in society just don't know enough about cooperatives. So what we need to do is to learn from each other, copy what works, take it out there and engage people in the cooperative idea and hopefully use a cooperative model as a way of solving some of the deep-seated problems which face so many of us. It's been really busy, there's been so many people that we've been able to get to know and it's just, yeah, it's just been really exciting to meet everyone. I think it's gone really well. I think it's been very well attended, very busy. Amazing to see people coming here to Manchester from all over the world for this event. Uh, it's been a tremendous success and probably everybody has done very well organising it. Um, and I think the, the benefits of it are hopefully people will see and share that they're not their own little co-op. There's lots of co-ops and take that back with them and set up networks for younger people to be more engaged in the cooperative movement, um, which there's new legislation that allows under 16s to become members of cooperatives, and it's by engaging the younger people, hopefully it's something that will continue for years to come.